Welcome back. Well, you've heard the question or maybe thought about it yourself. What words do you want to leave behind on your tombstone? We're taking a concept and we're updating it actually to the 21st century. Some really neat technology changes so you can leave behind messages, memories, mm -hmm. precious photos, or you know, even just videos mm -hmm. to your, for your loved ones to enjoy anytime. Here to tell us about the Be Remembered online community are Kim Wade with Millward Funeral Directors. Thank you so much. Thank so we'll get to this um, technology in a second, but first tell us kind of how you got involved in this whole process. Well, I'm the marketing director for Millward and I do a lot of the community events for them. And um, we were approached by the company that provide, we buy caskets from and they created this software that is called beremember.com mm -hmm. and basically they bring it to the funeral directors and allow us to sponsor the software so that we're letting people tell their life story yeah. um, before anything happens to them. And we're seeing a big change. It's more about, you know, remembering life and, exactly. and living it in now as opposed to looking back and this is a great tool to help you along. Absolutely. I mean we're so busy these days and it's hard to sit down and put a scrapbook together mm -hmm. um, but yet we're taking lots and lots of pictures especially with our iPhones. It's so easy. Very easy and so um, like we talked about earlier you just pick up your phone and you show them a picture mm -hmm. um, but this is allowing you to take those pictures off your phones or the video off your phone upload to it to the Be Remembered site and um, it's always there. Um, basically what happens is we, um, anybody who sets up a Be Remembered story page, okay. um, they put in their information, tell their story, and then they um, will give people um, that are close to them, maybe it's their spouse yeah. or their best friend or, or even the funeral director, mm -hmm. um, permission to access their story. Yeah. Um, and so that story is there and it's private um, during the time that they're living. Mm -hmm. And then when the time comes that you know they become ill um, or they pass away, that's when the, the story can be unlocked and it can be shared with lots and lots of people that have loved them. It's not something that everything thinks about, but it is no. inevitable. And this Absolutely. is actually something a lot of it you can do, uh, doesn't necessarily to pertain to after you pass away, but before. I mean, there's tools like a bucket list. You could write yes. out a list of things that you want to accomplish in your life. Uh -huh. uh, I mean, it's a very unique tool. Tell us about some of the options that people could specifically use. Well, basically, um, the story is the primary thing that people mm -hmm. use it for um, so that they can upload the videos. And it, it could be videos of you climbing Mount Everest, <laughs> or it could be videos with you just at a softball game where you're watching your grandkids play or your kids mm -hmm. um, in some cases, um, up and loading the photos and like you said the bucket list. Um, it lets you put all those things that you desire to do like climbing Mount mm -hmm. Everest or, or going to a Cubs game or um, I guess I should say Reds around here. Yeah, Cubs is cool, <laughs> but, with me at least. <laughs> <laughs> but anyways, it, it allows you to put all those things that you want to do in there. It's kind of mm -hmm. like a, a virtual calendar um, and photo album yeah. all wrapped up in one. And you can even make a video that will play after uh, the yes. fact and, and you know it's important to say you know this is what's been on my mind and this yes. is what I want to really let you know. So an awesome tool, technology always changing and you guys are making it easier than right. ever. If people want to check this out what's the easiest way to Just go to our website um, www.millwardfuneral.com and um, in the menu bar it says beremembered.com mm -hmm. and it kind of just has an overview and of course they're always welcome to call us at our um, downtown location. And most importantly, you said it actually is very easy to go about the whole it's process. It's very too. easy and we're encouraging people. I mean, not everybody's computer literate. Mm -hmm. um, so a, a lot of um, older people that haven't really used the computer as much might borrow their grandchild yeah. or or their um, son or daughter well, to help them out. It's something fun to do out. together too. Yes. Well, thanks for stopping by and we appreciate Thank you this. For having uh, me. A unique tool that I'm sure a lot of people didn't know existed. So thanks for bringing that to Thank us. Thank you. All right. Well, exercise, history, and a gorgeous, gorgeous backdrop. The three things you can find at a huge event happening this weekend in Frankfurt. We'll have all the details coming up next.